guys, I'm back and I'm actually really excited but also really nervous because I am in the Target parking lot and I'm going to try to do my first price match. Um, for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about or like what to do with the price match, I'm going to be price matching to Walmart. So basically you look it up on Walmart and you find a product that is pretty cheap and you go to Target and you be, you're like, hey, do you price match? price match Walmart which most stores do they'll say yes and you show them your phone what's been going around is that you change locations luckily mine is actually like literally a block or two down the street from this so I don't think I should have any problems with this and it's not like an insanely cheap price like the two dollar Charmin that everyone's doing mine isn't that low um, and I'm okay with that because it's my first one so basically, I found the Charmin. I actually forgot the size of it right now, but I'll show you guys exactly what it looks like. I'm gonna be price matching it for $7. So these are normally 16 in the store, but not only am I getting it for $7 if this all works out the way I hope it does. Um, when you buy three products, certain products at Target, they're gonna give you a $10 gift card. So they come out to be even cheaper and once this all happens or once it doesn't happen, I'll give you guys the breakdown um, mathematically so you guys can see exactly what the numbers look like. But basically, I'm gonna be getting each um, $16 bag of toilet paper um, for like $3 a piece. Okay, so here we are. It's a 16 mega roll of a 64. They're normally $15.99 here. So this is the one that we're gonna be looking at getting for $7 a piece. Okay guys, so I have them in my cart. Like I said, I'm gonna be getting three of them. 16 mega 64 regular blah blah blah, ultra strong. Price matching for the $7. I'm getting really nervous. She didn't look happy. Okay guys, so as you can see, I was able to get them. This is actually the second store, so I'll tell you guys what happened um, with the first one. Um, it didn't go as planned, so I, as you can see, I got them for $7, which is good. Um, but it didn't give me a gift card so it didn't give me the ten dollar gift card and i honestly didn't want to argue with her or like not even argue but like ask her because it is my first time so i'm kind of nervous and i didn't want her to like call a manager and then be like hey did you scan it and you know so i'm still getting them for seven dollars a piece and for me that's still okay being my first time so i'm okay with it i'll let you guys know what happened at the first store okay guys so at the first store um there was only one check stand open but the girl looked like she, she looked pretty cool so I was like no problem at all regardless I'll be fine so I went in her line and there's literally one person in front of me as I'm about to put one of the toilet paper bags on the thing they open another check stand and they're like I can take you over here and I'm like oh my god no it's this freaking guy who is accompanied with the manager because he's new so I was like um I'm just trying to price match this at Walmart and then as soon as I said that, the manager was like, yeah, I'll go ahead and scan it. She scans it, nothing comes up. So I was like, okay, thank you. And I leave without any items. Literally a couple, like 10 minutes down from that Target, there's another one. So I decided I'm already out here. Probably not the best thing to keep driving to different Target. But I came to this other one. I should have done this from the beginning because this Target is actually the one that gave me the rain checks for the Dawn the like 75 ounce one when it was a dollar and 50 cents um so i should have came here regardless everyone is like super young at this store and just like laid back and whatnot so i walked in here i saw two cashiers both of them look golden i grabbed my stuff came to the school and she was i was like i'm just trying to price match these to walmart she's like oh yeah totally and i showed her the screenshot not the screenshot the website and she's like oh my god that's such a steal like that's awesome and i was like yeah thanks and so she processed everything like that she was super bubbly and then 
she wouldn't she I paid with a gift card but at the end she didn't say anything about a gift card and like I mentioned earlier I didn't want to say anything because I didn't want something to happen and then like take it back and at seven dollars I'm still okay so since I didn't get that gift card they ended up being seven dollars instead of the three I was looking for um, but hopefully if you guys price match you're able to get that gift card um, later on when I get more confidence and I know a little bit more I would probably say something to get that gift card um, and if you guys can give me any tips on like what to do or how to do it really like I said this is my first price match so any tips about anything regarding price matching is greatly appreciated and I won't be releasing this zip code for it just because it is actually where I live um, like I mentioned but I do have other zip codes that I can give you guys and I'll post that in the description as well if you guys are like expert price matchers and stuff like that so have a wonderful 4th of July, stay safe, um, drink a lot of water, if it's hot because it's hot here, I need to take this off. And I'll see you guys in just a couple days, we'll see what we come up with. Walgreens is going to be popping next week, so definitely tune in on Sunday for sure. So now I'm going to go get my free food. up a Postmates order and there was like five different four pretzels and then the pretzel bites as well as cheese I think I paid maybe like 20 cents for all of this